The great Benjamin Franklin is credited with having discovered electricity in a thundercloud. Ooh, that's smart. But was he actually the first one to be uh, shocked by this discovery? Let us go back to the early colonial days, to the modest laboratory of Hector Heathcote, a young man determined to gain fame as an inventor. Winston, there are so many things needed, I don't know what to invent first. How about inventing a cork that says mom instead of pop? Unfortunately, Heathcote had a neighbor who was also interested in gaining fame, the easy way. I've got it, Winston, I've got it. The stovepipe tent. I say, that's a topper. Heathcote's got something there, and I'm glad I thought of it. <laughs> Screwdriver, pliers, hammer. There, a stovepipe tent. There's even a grill for roasting chestnuts. Well, I'm off to the patent office. Hold it. Hold it. What are those? Stovepipe hats. But Heathcote was not discouraged. I've thought of something even better than a stovepipe hat. This will be the greatest crime preventative of all time. Heathcote's answer to the criminal, the stocks. By George, that's good, the stocks. Yes, sir, this will be a real humane method of punishment. <coughs> that's him, officer. He's stealing my invention. And what is this instrument of torture called? The stocks. Realizing that he faced strong competition, Heathcote went into a flurry of activity. First, he tried inventing the umbrella. You need an umbrella! <laughs> and then, the alarm clock. Just a few more touches, Winston, and the alarm clock will be complete. I'll put them on first thing in the morning. Alarm clock, eh? I'm certainly glad you set the alarm clock. Now I can get an early start on my invention of the... Alarm clock? Somebody has been stealing my inventions. And when I find him, I'm going to really tell him off. At least you don't have far to look. Benedict. Go fly a kite. What's a kite? Uh, there's no such thing. It's just a figure of speech, like, uh, go soak your head, which might be a very good idea. <laughs> you certainly told him off. No, he told me. Benedict said, go fly a kite. I'm going to invent a kite and fly it. Thank heavens. I thought he was going to invent a head and soak it. We'll see how Benedict feels when someone steals his ideas. Of course, Heathcote didn't know that kites had been invented centuries ago, but neither did Benedict. And so on one stormy day, he charged Heathcote's laboratory. He can't do that. That's my idea. Come back here, Heathcote. That's my invention. I'll stop him. Here. Heathcote, you just invented the flying door. Get me out of here! Try unlocking the door. It works! I'm flying a kite, and it was my idea. All mine! And so Benedict was probably the first one to get a charge out of flying a kite. Winston, there must be some use for that invention. If you could invent an extension cord to fit Benedict, we could light up the whole town. 